Back again, man. Back with another one. Hope y'all having a great day. Today, I'm going to be getting into this Fetrix tutorial with the hi-hats, man. I'm going to show you guys how I use the Fetrix on my hi-hats to make the hi-hats saucy, man. Uh, it's going to juice your hi-hats up, man. So, we're going to get straight into it. I'm going to go ahead and route this to a master track, or route this to a track, rather. Pull up a Fetrix. I'm going to go ahead and play the beat so you guys can hear. It's a little beat I drew up, so I'll let you guys hear that real quick. It's nice little chords, right? Some chords. So what I mainly use right here is X loop and loop. Uh, sometimes I use reverse, right? So those would be like the three main things. That I'll be showing you guys that I use on my hi hats when I'm being lazy, you know what I mean. Don't feel like drawing them in or, or something like that. You can use the Fetrix, and it'll give it somewhat of a different feel than just drawing them in, right? So that's one advantage of using it sometimes. Um. So first thing is one out of thirty-two. If you use that, you can use it, but it'll kind of be repetitive as far as like, um your bars it only give you like you know one bar so I'll, I'll play it and i'll let you see what i mean so so you got a 116th it'll give you a little more room to play with or one eighth i like using one eighth You know, the longer you uh, draw it out, the the less you have to draw out these boxes. So, you know, 132 is going so fast, you have to make the boxes longer for for the effect to last. On 18 and stuff is is breaking it down, so it's, it's moving slower. So you don't need to draw the boxes out as far. So just one box would do. So yeah, you use loop. I use loop, X loop. See how that gave the, the hi hats a vibe already, man. I didn't have to spend 20 minutes or you know, 10 minutes, five minutes, however fast you are, however fast you know I am, however long it takes either of us to do it. It didn't take that long. You uh, use a Fetrix, draw that in, use reverse, uh, you know, gave it some sauce. Sounds good. I mean, you can even use a reverb. I don't really use a reverb too much on here. I, I like to use fruity reverb, but it is something you could use. Uh, you can take this down, you know. change is mess with the set so if you click on this x loop has pitch change right here i like to mess with that a little bit sometimes so you'll see what i mean you kind of pitch it up or pitch it down right now it's at 26 percent so it's kind of pitching it up at 26 percent so let me turn that up uh maybe 50 percent see what it sounds like so it kind of went faster now let's try it down just to show you guys Pitching it down. So let's make it longer. with 
with that as much. I mean, it has this, I leave it on default, it has this preset, but. thing that I would mess with on this one is the speed uh, everything else is really really not necessary kind of does the same effect whether you kind of want to pitch it down how fast you want it to go Be creative with it, man. You know, you could layer things on top of each other. Let's try to lay, layer uh, the tonal delay with the reverse. See what that sounds like. You know, get, you get creative with it. Put a little phaser with it. Might have to change the cutoff on that phaser. Sorry, it's just filter. Let's do phaser. So you know you can see what you like in it. You need to leave it on, take it off. Reverb is another one you can use. You can mess with the wet level, the size of the room. scratch at the end you put the venom scratch at the end you know uh where the hi-hats cut off so there's a lot of things you can do man a lot of things you can do with with just with this one plug-in on your hi-hats that's so why it's one of my favorite plugins. switch it up even more man you can use one fourth that'll give you even uh longer like room to play with as far as you know the the rest of your bars on your on your beat so use that switch it up that way the the first two bars won't sound like the next two right so See, my melody doesn't really go that long so mine's not even getting to this to this part over here right so that's why i'm just on one eight
See, man, whole time you still just got the regular two-step hi-hat. So that's one way that I like to quickly uh, enhance my hi-hats, man. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Hit that uh, like button for me. To help me out. Hit that subscribe button, man. Got new content dropping every day. You don't want to miss it. But that's all I got for y'all today, man. I'll see y'all in the next video. Signing out.